Oh, you got one, Bob. Oh, yeah. A big one. <laughs> oh, it is a Whoa, big get, one. Whoa, get that net. <laughs> oh, my God. Bob, it jumped oh, off. No. I tried to dive for it. <laughs> that was a nice one. That was your four or five pounder that right was, there. <laughs> that was a nice one. I, I tried to dive. I saw oh. it. <laughs> oh, son. That's. Now, Chris, his PB ain't but like five, six. You know how it close we were getting to it? That was that was Bob's PB there. Yeah, it was about Bob's PB. That was Bob's PB. That was there. Retro bassin', kicking some ass and wearing rayon jackets. Thinking about Bill Dance, watching these fish prance through my Ray-Ban glasses. Ain't nothing better than 40-year-old lures coming off of Zepco 33. Bass boat making beer cans float, doing some trespassing. Fishing it old school, this old stuff rules. Welcome to Retro Bassin. Welcome to Retro Bassin. You know, since moving to Florida a, a few months ago, uh, there's a few things that I thought I would have done by now that for whatever reason I haven't. And one of those is do a little bit of a retro bassin with a couple of my favorite bassin buds, John and Lindia over at Small Water Charters. Well, uh, we are gonna accomplish sort of half of that today. Uh, a few weeks ago, I got a call from John and said that he had a bassin bud from the Retro Bassin Show by the name of Bob, who had actually watched a couple of our episodes fishing with Small Water Charters. And he booked, I think it was two or three days down here in Central Florida fishing with John. Well, anyway, John thought it'd be a pretty good idea to surprise Bob and hop on the charter with him and John. So that is exactly what I'm doing. I got up early this morning to drive down to Central Florida and I'm about two minutes from the boat ramp to hopefully surprise Bass and Bud Bob who from what John says, they've already caught some fish up to three pounds. I do have, of course, some old school rods rigged up and ready to go, as well as some old school tackle that hopefully Bob will be fishing with. We are on a little lake uh, just south of Orlando, and according to John, the spawn bite is on big time. And I think I see John's truck right there. <laughs> All right, Bass and Buds. Well, we have got John and Bass and Bud Bob, who came all the way from Wisconsin to fish with us. So, man, that's, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> this is a dream come true. The best part is I brought some old school lures for Bob to fish with, but apparently he was already fishing old school before we got here. So, Bob, <laughs> I have a Mr. Twister top prop. I think that totally counts as a retro bass and bait. And you caught a three pounder on it? This Earlier this already. morning, absolutely. I'll send you a pick, Chris. You can put it in. <laughs> and he right didn't back. even have the retro bass and hat on when he did that. He I didn't, didn't. No. not yet. <laughs> <laughs> but awesome. Yeah, part of MEPS now. Mr. Twister is a part of MEPS. I told John before I came down, I'm a homer. So I want to fish with some Wisconsin stuff. So Mr. Twister, MEPS, they're going to go on too. <laughs> and I was super close to bringing the top prop because it's actually. I don't know if they've discontinued it or it's hard to get, but I, th I feel like they've discontinued they it. They have, yep. So, officially a retro bait. And it works. It works. <laughs> that fish exploded on it, too. It, it did. Was a good bite. Well, I like the old top prop, huh? Oh, yeah. I might get it done, son. <laughs> a three pounder engulfed it, man. It was quite a good bite. You guys are working the lures quick today? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Splashy, splashy. Splat the more splash and the better. If you can splash and go slow. All right, well, in preparation for this trip, uh, John was talking about how absolutely shallow and weedy the fish were hitting. So I kind of uh, dug through what retro lures I happened to have on me in Florida, and I found two old school packs of Bass Pro Shops topwater tubes. First one is this guy, the uh, frog pattern. I think these might have come out maybe in the 90s. This is cool, it's a tube, but it's actually a pretty thick tube. So it actually casts really well and floats pretty well. And then I've also got this one, the old top water tube in the rat. So it might be uh, old, uh, when, when Bob gets tired of the top prop, I might throw on this top water tube rat. Nice weedless bait and uh, we'll see if they work. So then why'd they leave? What happened? 
They never even said. They just said we're going in a different direction creatively. Really? I feel like if I put out a video that said I wasn't going to join the Googans, it would do well. Yeah. Maybe I'll do that. Yeah, just have a little say. While John and I left the Googans, <laughs> we were waiting around for the invite. It never came, so we're going to quit. We're gonna... You can't fire me. I quit. Oh, oh, Bob's got. <laughs> Retro. <laughs> This is what happens, Bob, when you go fish with me. I'm sorry. This is what you sign up for. <laughs> Little rats doing it, though. Yeah. Uh-oh. John's got a big one. That's a nice one, man. Ain't bad for a little... <laughs> yeah, buddy. Today. Look at that dude. See, I have to show these guys. See, they don't believe me there's fish back here, so you got to show them once <laughs> They're number one. If you saw, I caught that in no water. There's what, a foot maybe up there, six inches? Yeah. And that wasn't retro. But it could have been. That's okay. We'll get some retro. Don't worry. Yeah, but two out of three ain't bad, John. Two out of three ain't bad. Uh oh, yeah. John's hooked up. Get him on top. Woohoo. You still got him. Yep. There you go. Now you yeah, got him surfing. Guy. Not a nice one. That is. Yeah, buddy, that's a green fish, too. That's Florida. That's a Lake Jackson pretty one. Look at that guy. Too little, but three little males back in these shallows. That's all I can do is show you guys. <laughs> Note to self, raise power. All right, so here you go, Bob. This is the next one. So the topwater tube rat. So this is, do you remember this at all? I do. Yes. Yep. I think Old this is like I'm pretty sure shop. this is like the '90s or maybe Early like late 90s, late '80s. Yep. It could be like an '89 deal. Yeah. Yep. But it's a it's a tube. It's like thick though. Feel yeah. It. Yep. It's thick and it's got air pockets in it. Almost it feels like pre-rigged. It looks like. Yep. At least yep. got one in there. It's almost sacrilege to open this. I feel bad. Oh. Yeah, the only the only thing is though, if you actually catch a fish on it, then it's all worthwhile because we got it on film. So then I it consider is. that. Uh, or yeah. <laughs> and can you imagine today there was a person checking that checkbox oh 100 back in the day Boy. that would never happen today you know this is a rat so just in case you weren't sure which of the two versions right <laughs> uh oh bob's got one whoa Look at that. yeah buddy <laughs> oh man big fish of the day too Look at that. Look at that. His first one was bigger, but that's a pretty fish. Hey. <laughs> Perfect hook set even. I mean, look right. Oh. Right on the roof of the mouth, right where you want them. Fishing it old school with the Bass Pro Shops vintage rat. <laughs> it comes out just that easy. Let me get oh, there. look at that. Still. You said you wanted to catch one with retro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that knot held, too. I tied it extra loose. So I didn't want to competition us. It's unfortunate. I thought that'd be coming off, but that's a great fish, man. Good job. <laughs> awesome. Got him. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> Retro basses. Retro that one. That was another uh reach for the camera. Yeah, that was another one. That was a uh, well. Was that a did it feel a nicer fish? That felt nicer. For a moment it well, for a moment. Then it felt like nothing. Yeah, well. Oh, what can At least we're getting a few hits. That's better. And it seems to, in a weird kind of way, I think we're getting better. Yeah, it's hard to say. He's picking up. All right, John's got one. Woo! <laughs> give him no time. There Look at that go. guy. Had to tie it back up with the bruiser baits. That's two retro, two <laughs> bruiser. <laughs> Here we go. Can I at least hold a fish? You yeah, I, haven't, I, haven't, I haven't felt one today, so I at least want to see if... Wow, look at that. There. there we go. I'll fix that in the editing process, John. Don't worry. All right, got another nice fish. Man, I'm really killing it today. Hold it closer <laughs> yeah. to the camera, Joe. There you go. That's a... It's getting smoked, as I usually am on the boat, but that's all right. Nice fish. <laughs> Bob, you've probably been throwing towards that green egg in front of you, but if you have, that's a good little line. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah. Got him? Get him up. There we go. Get him up. <laughs> I'm getting him. <laughs> <laughs> so
surfing them. <laughs> I'm surfing, doing something. <laughs> we got movement at least. We got movement. I didn't lose him yet. Oh, oh didn't lose him yet. Nope. He's still there. Still there. Oh, let's get him in. All right. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh. Wow. <laughs> With some salad. <laughs> Man, I've got to tell you, that was it's a lot of work for a one pound bass. I said that in our last video. That right? was a lot of work. A lot of work for one bass. Don't throw it until I get a picture. <laughs> I won't. I won't. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. Well, I got him on the top. I wasn't going to lose him. I tried my best to shake him loose between the uh, strike and the boat, but he, he stayed on. So There we go. All right. Finally, a little retro bass for me. Man, yeah. better late than never, huh? Better late than never. <laughs> But they are picking up biting. They, they are slowly up. picking up biting. Oh, man. Bob cast the rat one too many times, and we done lost the hook in the body. <laughs> Indeed. So switching up. You are going to keep it old school, which is what I like to see. So what do we got here? A little Hawaiian wiggler. Nice. A little, is that skirt a little custom job? A there? little custom job. <laughs> yep, just something to give a little I think flare. they always come with a skirt, but. They came with a living rubber skirt. They did, but that's a little silicone one that I threw on there because the living rubber had died <laughs> and look how quickly john jumps in your grave there look at that see that that's a, i know that is a professional right there there we go oh bob's got one another nice one. Oh, that's the one. Oh, get the net <laughs> this is not a pb but i'll take it hey that's all right <laughs> Did you already spit your bait? Good. Uh-oh, uh, let's see. He choked the bait. <laughs> my phone and camera. Oh, oh son, look at that. <laughs> there we go. The Hawaiian wiggler. Oh, he, he choked it. <laughs> he Hold choked on. It. Don't, don't. Look at that. Holy cow, he <laughs> choked it. He wanted it. <laughs> Good job, Bob. That's what, your fourth in the boat? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think so. Yeah. Right here, I'll let it sink. Oh! Yeah! Woo! -hoo. <laughs> but that dude sink beside the boat. Yeah, buddy. Look at that one. Check him Another out. Another nice one. Nice. For little dinks, but. Yep. yep. Oh, you're good. Whoa! Oh my goodness, John! <laughs> oh my God, that's a donkey. That's a pretty one. And I wasn't real, and I was Woo! messing with his oh fish. Oh my gosh! Yep. Chris, you missed it. My rod was laying there, and it started going doom, doom, doom. Wasn't even touching it. There's oh another. man, look at that one, dude. Lake Jackson bass. Look how fat. <laughs> oh man, holy cow! Look at you two. Woo! <laughs> That's how it's done, right. retro. Right there. Oh, oh gosh. You got one. <laughs> I got one. <laughs> oh, that's that's. A little, a little bigger fish. Get to it? Yeah. 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 Be there. Keep pressure because he. Yep. You still feeling? Yes, sir. I mean, I feel. I got think pressure. that's a. I feel pressure. You don't feel shaking or that. I don't know. Yeah, it's hard to say. I, I, I think I feel life. They snicker you so bad in there like that. <laughs> Get up on here. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what you call delayed gratification. Oh, oh my! Dude, come up out of there too, did he? If I'd have been a gator, we'd all got here. There we go. Well, that's a nice one for me for the day, at least. Good one. Look at that. Pretty fish. I'm glad he stayed on. Oh my so goodness, bad. Bass and Buzz! Look at that. That is a dark, dark-looking Florida bass. Bob, these fish are dark, aren't they? They are very dark. <laughs> awesome. Well, that, that and he absolutely choked it. <laughs> All right, Bass and Buds. Well, we had a blast of a day out here in Central Florida. All three of us caught some nice fish. I think Bob definitely had the hot rod of the day, catching some nice bass on some nice old school baits. Definitely uh, head on over to Small Water Charters and give John and Lindy a subscription, or even better yet, come down to Florida and book yourself a charter. If you're looking for some more old school content, you can click right here. Otherwise, we'll see you right back here, same time, same place. Until then, keep that carpet side up. And definitely, fish it old school. Fishing it old school, this old stuff rules. Welcome to Retro Bassoon.